Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Sorry it's been so long. Um, I think it's been about a week since I uploaded. I've just been really busy and just haven't been recording and kind of lost my nail mojo a little bit and a bit of love for YouTube but never mind. I'm back. So this client came in she said she wanted a prey nails and blue. So I've done all my usual prep work. The prep tools that I use are from Navy and their tools are amazing. Yes, they are pricey, but they're guaranteed for five years. So, you know, you really do get your money's worth. They are just amazing. And I do have a discount code for them, which is Liz10, if you want to go and purchase some. So I've gone in, prepped all of the nails, got rid of all the dead skin off the nail plate, pushed back the cuticles, etched the nail plate, dehydrated... And now I'm using the Epre Sculpting Gel, I think it's called. Anyway, you do a thin layer of that on all of the nails. You literally cure in your lamp for 30 seconds. Bring it out. I've already sized up the tips. And I've just e-filed um, just where it's going to be attached to the natural nail. Um, I'm not sure if you can see on the pinky finger, but it is just a bit of damage where she put, like banged her acrylic nail and um, when she had acrylics on and it just split a little bit there <clears throat> but it's not an open wound it's not um anything any cause for concern i've cleaned it all really well it's not split that down to the um nail bed or anything like that so it was really safe to put another nail on so i'm just placing these on placing it like tucking it in the cuticle bit and then kind of really pressing hard down to make sure all of the air bubbles like come out of the nail just want to make sure there's no big air bubbles that's kind of like the main thing and underneath there you can see that i have my vodex system on now i've set it up in my house i wasn't going to set it up in my kitchen because i am just about to move into my summer house um but my twister broke and so uh i've set this up and using this and i must say i'm really impressed the smell and fumes are like non-existent they're gone um, it does suck up the dust. It sucks up the more finer dust. Some of the bigger particles do kind of shoot away. Um, but it does suck up the little, the small bits of dust. So that's good. So yeah, I'm just curing each nail for 10, was it 30 seconds? I think it starts on the little lamp. I cure that with the little mini lamp. And then after they've all been applied, I will then pop her hand in the lamp for a full cure for like 60 seconds. So after that, I'm just literally filing away the tip where the number is because she want, she didn't want them as long as they were, but she did just want the, the numbers filed off. We were going to paint over them anyway, so it was neither here nor there, but I think she was just a little bit intimidated by the length because um, she doesn't normally you like usually have them sculpted this long. So, um, yeah, we just literally filed down the number. And I know the apparatus say that you there's no need to file over the surface of the tip because it's, um, like, made of gel. Um, but I just do. I like to go around with my sanding band around that cuticle area just to make sure that it is all nice and flush. And when it grows out, there's not, like, a proper big step. Um... So I just go around with my sanding band. I don't know if I recorded me doing that. But that is what I do. I take my sanding band. I go around the cuticle and the sidewall area to make sure it's nice and flush and f like flat to the natural nail. And there's no gel that's seeped out or anything like that. So I like to make sure there's none on the skin and it's all nice and flush. And then I just quickly go over the whole nail. As you can see, they're a bit cloudy now. I obviously didn't record me doing that, but that is what I did. So my client then picked out this gorgeous colour from the gel bottle and it is from the spring collection called Michelle and it's just an absolute beaut. So gorgeous. And I'm just going to paint the nails with these. Really simple set, really easy to do. Just thought I'd record it and um, share with you just so I can pop in and say hello and I hope you're all doing really well. And yeah, so I'll add another coat of this after this, so two coats, and then I'll use the Apre gel top coat that you get with the kit. It is a tack-free, 
so I'll use that kill that in the lamp for 60 seconds and that is literally the set done like so easy how easy is that super super easy um i hope you all do really well if you do like this video please give me a thumbs up if you're not subscribed please do i would love it if you would um and i'll see you all again in my next video Bye bye